Hi, it's Deb from Deb's Days. It's Foster Friday, and I'm guessing you're back here for another edition of The Adventures of Wyatt, the kitten born without two back paws. It was definitely a week of trial and error, on both our parts. If you were with me last week, we talked about how Wyatt was a little teeny tiny guy coming into my foster home at about nine ounces when the rest of his siblings were pushing closer to a pound. So this week we made sure he had extra time with Mama Kate, and we started him on that gruel. That was the KMR, canned cat food, and jarred baby food mixture. He wouldn't eat it off the saucer like the rest of the kids, so we started by having him lick it off my finger. But by the end of the week, he was digging in like the rest, and he has the cute little face to prove it. One thing we've noticed about Wyatt is he likes to stay put. He'd just soon stay in one place on his back and have his sisters and brother come on over and play with him. Easy peasy and not a lot of work. But we have to make sure he gets out and about. He gets plenty of opportunity to watch the others climb and run and jump, and even tries to attempt some himself. We need to sometimes give him just a little bit of a boost to get him going, and then he can finish up on his own. He was struggling coming back from the cat tree, so I added a little extra blanket for him. Yeah, it didn't work so well for him. But we gave him another shot at it, and it worked great. We also gave him extra opportunities to try different surfaces to walk on. If you want a speedy kitty cat with only two paws, put a blanket down on top of a countertop and that little boy will take off. Once he gets a going, boy does he go. The carpet was another surface we worked with this week. If you notice, even on a flat surface, he walks a little bit crooked. He does struggle a bit more on those uneven surfaces, even if it's a blanket, or even if it's Mama's tail. Having one of his legs a little longer than the other puts him a bit off balance. As the week went on, he got braver and braver. He decided to jump from the couch to the carpet. Well, his way of jumping. But it worked. And he decided to try and climb up the side of the mesh pop-up pen. All the other babes have been in and out dozens of times, but he's never made it. I think he's on his way. As the week went on, he got more confident in his couch jumping abilities as well. No sliding down a couch this time. What would draw him to jump so quickly, so fast, and so confidently? Well, food, of course, thanks to Mama Kate's buffet. Sweet, right? Join me next week as we check out the next adventures of Wyatt. Who knows what kind of trouble he's going to get himself into. You can find that video by subscribing to my YouTube channel or heading over to the blog at debsdays.com and clicking on the Foster Kitten section. And head on over to simplycats.org where you can find out more about fostering. It's also where you'll find the Wild West Gang up for adoption when the time comes.